we're going to be making two recipes, one sweet and then one savoury. This is my first time making these types of recipes. I've done cinnamon scrolls before but it wasn't sourdough so um, this was my first time doing a sourdough one. And to be honest, it was actually the first time I made a sourdough cinnamon scroll. It was better than the better than the next second time I did it. If that makes sense. So like um yesterday, I think it was yesterday or the day before when I'm doing this voiceover, I um made the second batch of cinnamon scrolls because I'm trying to perfect the recipe so I can put a solo um cinnamon roll recipe on um, my second channel. Which well, second channel doesn't have any videos yet because I just uh, made it. There will be a video soon though. Actually, when you when this video comes out, there probably will be a video. And then the second recipe, I have made a mince pie before, me and Tisha, but it was terrible. But this um pie was completely different. It was awesome. Like it was really good. I tried making it into a pepper pie, but it didn't really turn into a pepper pie because like I didn't put enough um pepper in it, which is a shame. So if you want to like do a like a pepper like a um, mince pie, do heaps more um pepper than I did, which you will see in the um, end but if you just here for the mince pie recipe I will um, put timestamps um, in the description so you don't have to waste your time watching the cinnamon scrolls For the first time I made these um spelt um Seldo cinnamon scrolls, um it was um like for me I'm not I don't have much of a sweet tooth so I don't really like sweet stuff so it was actually quite sweet for me. So the second time I made it, I put less sugar in it and it just wasn't as good. So um with the main recipe when I do do that, I'm gonna just have it more like this recipe where it has more sugar in it because it just tastes more better. And uh, with the second recipe, I actually when I made it, I thought I did all the like the same ingredients I put in this recipe but I didn't. I actually forgot to put some of the ingredients in like um, butter and salt and that definitely changed a bit like the butter in this recipe made it so much more fluffier and then um, the second batch of um, cinnamon scrolls there was no butter because I forgot and it just wasn't as fluffy.
And if you're enjoying the video, don't forget to like and subscribe. We post a video every week on Friday to Sunday, one of those days. First time me and Tish made um, a steak pie, the, um, the steak pie had actual meat, this one has mince in it. We, um, it was turning out all good, but we accidentally um, overcooked the meat and made too much dough. So the crust was too thick and the filling was just burnt. And for some odd reason, even though we burnt it, it turned out really salty, even though we didn't put a lot of salt in it. I don't know why that turned out like that, but it was just disgusting. So that's why I'm so glad this one turned out really good. Um, for improvement with this one, uh, I would, yeah, definitely more pepper in the, um, actual filling to make it more of the peppy steak pie. But overall, I think it's actually pretty good. It doesn't really need any improvement. Maybe I could put, like, the little carrots in the filling instead. Well, I mean, add them to. Um, but overall, I don't think it really needs any other improvement. Every time I've ever made a pastry, I've never put butter in it. Like, I put butter in it, but I put melted butter. I never put butter like the, like what I'm doing right now on screen, where I've, like, put the butter in with, with the flour and, like, and like broken up with my hands. I've never done that before. I don't think I really made much of a difference, to be honest, um, but that's just how I did it. You can do it however you want. You can melt the butter, or you can do it how I just did it. I think they both turn out the same, well, for me anyway.
And if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and subscribe and watch another one of our videos. Thank you, bye.